yeah, this is going to be a really basically quick video. I do a lot of things on my computers and to uh, streamline my workflow, I like using tablets. And tablets are obviously, they give your artistic creativity the boost that usually is required. It's hard to draw with a mouse. So uh, a while ago, uh, my uh, Wacom tablet kind of shit the bed, so I deep six that. And I recently purchased this uh, uh, Huion Canvas Pro 16, which is, uh, I gotta say, it's an amazing tablet for the money. There's like no way a few years ago you could have purchased something like this for, for that kind of money in, in the mid 300s. It works for everything, which was great. I mean, every program that I utilize it has no no issues with, it, except for one, one of my main programs, which is the Photoshop program. And it just didn't want to be recognized within the program for some reason, and I went crazy through the internet looking, you know, what can I do? I replaced uh, the, the driver, you know, uh, probably about 10 times, going from different version to different version, and it would it would work maybe the first time that the driver was loaded and then it would stop working and for some reason every once in a while it would work again and I couldn't understand why and I couldn't find any problem any uh, reasonable solution on the internet for it and I found my solution for it which was uh, it works for me every time so if you have this issue in Photoshop all you have to do is uh, go to the main tablet program bring it up and you know you have these four buttons here and I believe it's in the about it'll ask you on the bottom uh, administrative mode and you want to click that because as soon as you do all the functions in Photoshop go on and uh, evidently it's gone you know if you see that that's probably your problem and uh, it, it's worked for me and it's flawless now I don't have to worry about you know waiting for a new driver which who knows when you know they would probably rectify that problem or maybe they could just put out like a little notation in in their website or something like that. But anyway, that fixed my problem. And if anybody else is having this issue, try that because most likely that's going to solve your issue right right away. All right, take it easy.